And welcome back to Angels Anonymous 333, darlings. <clears throat> this is a continuation of a series I made on the TikTok. So if uh, you want to see that, I would highly suggest that. If you didn't, it is Angels Anonymous just 33. A lot of threes out there. So anywho, thanks for following me over if that is the case, darling. And also, I'm thinking about posting um, more Zodiac signs and divine feminine divine masculine stuff so let me know in the comments down below darling if that is something that you would be interested in okay so anyways i'll just do a quick overview um you, and then i'll just get to the to the meat in the bones okay um so um you are getting a wish fulfillment because of your divine connection with the universe and i'm getting because also these two kind of no, they don't exactly have the same coloring, but like connected to the universe, connected to the universe. Um, you are a divine being, okay? Star seed. You could be a star seed is what I'm getting to. Um, so what's up? Welcome. Thank you. Um, and you're manifesting this Ten of Pentacles. But to get that, you're kind of going through, I feel like this also outer conflict turning to inner conflict. Uh, I feel like the conflict has probably passed but they're still in our conflict about it um so the queen of swords is like watching the seven of swords like i know like i already know and i'm guarding myself i'm here i'm on guard but you are <clears throat> letting it burn do 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 great song i used to like that was one of my first cds as a kid <laughs> the usher cd um so ten of swords letting letting something burn to have a brand new beginning like uh like again the phoenix burning everything down to build something new um it's hard though it's hard to move forward but you're doing it but you understand that you have to let go of this it's like a battle that you can't win with someone that's not putting in energy so you can't win a battle against someone that's not fighting you know, you know I, I mean you know what i mean and you know this and you are manifesting creating your own i didn't even notice these are runes up there yeah you could just be like an alchemist too and like finding more finding out about alchemy also like i never noticed this about the card but like she's closing her eyes but like her eyes are open like that and emphasis on the third eye just a little white light so in meditation about it getting downloads is really what i'm getting um so dope energy. Also, the overall energy. And, like, I pulled these cards on TikTok. And this is why I pull the live cards. Because you get the wheel, which is, like, karma's on your side. Like, uh, also, I never noticed this, too. The light and the dark. You are balanced. Luck is in your favor. She has the dice. She has, okay, that's ten. Six, six plus four is ten. So completion of a cycle for a new one. Amazing. Walking away. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. Um, leaving leaving that in the trash okay and going forward into the light this is like such a beautiful reading like uh, and this is why this is one of my favorite decks i think this deck and i don't know the movie deck is pretty dope uh there's just so many and i the disney villain deck is awesome all right so let's see we're gonna see what uh your manifestations are gonna be we're gonna see what's coming okay Four of Swords, somewhere where you don't, f wait, is this two? Yeah, it's two. Okay. You know what? I'm not going to take these because they were stuck together. All right. Sometimes I'm like, I just want one. And then usually it's the same kind of message though. So let's see. Yeah, Three of Pentacles, right? So um, you're working on something. You're, you're working on manifesting. You could be working on manifesting with someone else. 404 on the clock. Yeah, three, two, th uh, two threes, right in a row. I love when that happens. Manifesting, celebrating, uh, could be just, you know, with friends. Um, you are in a new chapter and you want to reap your bennies with people that are like-minded. Um, this could be like, celebrate. okay, it could be with friends, it could be with family, it could, you know, or it could just be you're working on something and celebrating your own benefits. It doesn't have to be with people. But because of this, okay, it always does that. Oh, judgment. Judgment day is coming. Okay, I love, judgment card is one of my favorite cards. Um, hold on, something dropped. Let's see. 
Yeah, Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Judgment Day has come. This is, again, sort of like the Wheel of Fortune that you got over here. It's like the wheel can turn in favor and not in favor. Good karma, bad karma. You are reaping the bennies of your good karma. You're celebrating. You're working on something. You're you're manifesting straight up. <laughs> but the person who was the Knight of Pentacles, because we also had the King of Pentacles in reverse, um was taking their sweet darn time, darling. And, um, like, they don't have anything to show for it. But you are manifesting, giving yourself to the universe. And this is also a spiritual awakening, too. So it could be another awakening. Also, if this is a divine counterpart, We'll try not to put labels on it because everything is so complicated. <laughs> um, uh, again, mirroring each other, but in different ways, right? One's light, one's dark. Also, it could be like you thought like this person was sort of like that, like the like a counterpart of you, cause, but you were more light and they were darker, you know? All right, let's see what else is coming. Okay, yeah. Ooh, the Emperor, the Nine of Cups. And the Knight of Wands. I'm going to clarify the Knight of Wands. All right. Because this, to me... Hold on. Okay. A lot of fiery energy we get going on here. Uh, the Emperor... I was, like, I was thinking, I'm like, this is, like, someone new. Because you're getting someone that's your match, right? You're getting someone that... Like, the emperor to me is someone someone who could rule a kingdom. Also, I'm watching all of the Lord of the Rings over in The Hobbit this weekend. Someone that's, like, an honorable king. Like, someone that's not gonna, um... I'm not gonna go into it, because I could talk about it. But someone that's going to be, you know... The emperor has... It has mastered cups, pentacles, wands, um swords right so they have all of them they're not just one so you want a king it's not even a king um you want someone that is on your level well-rounded and that is your wish fulfillment um uh, but then we have the knight of wands in reverse with the two of wands um it could be either that it could be a few things you know what hold on let me just see it could be, to me, I'm like, this could be someone trying to come back and, like, disguise themselves as this and, like, want to make that leap with you. Um, but the Knight of Wands in reverse, like, you don't know if you can trust it or not. Uh, but it also could be someone new coming in. And because of this in the past, you, you're having a little bit of trust issues. I think it could be both, honestly. So let's keep going. Also, hit all those buttons if it resonates, darling. I would love to know if it does. The moon in reverse. You feel like something's not being revealed. Maybe that's why you don't trust it. Let's see. Ooh, the sun. But something's going to be brought to light. Okay. Six of pentacles in reverse. That something is not um, good to... Or not equal. It doesn't have... I'm sorry. I can't, like, put my words together that doesn't have like an equal give and take, but something's going to be brought to light about this. Again, you have like two cards of awakening. So I wanna see, I'm gonna clarify Six of Pentacles, see if we can do like old or new. All right, I think because it has bites from my cat, which is a little silly, right? It's the Three of Swords. No, no, okay, interesting, it's the Seven of Wands, which is also like, yeah, you're protecting yourself from this, you're like, you could be doing return to senders. You could be just really, you know, strengthening your auric shield kind of thing from this person and possibly from other people too. So you got to remember that. All right, let's do overall. And then we'll get you out of here, okay? <laughs> the higher font in reverse. Okay. You, I think, at this time are discerning what is going to be on your highest path, your highest journey, your highest self. Like, what aligns with that? Wow. Okay, yeah, okay. 
Uh, we have the Two of Cups, the Page of Cups. Okay, there could be a love offer or, you know, also a connection um, and an offer of love, but it's a page, okay? And you are a high priestess because that's the highest energy that came out. This highest energy that came out for this, oh, actually, you know what? Was, yes, the Emperor, but the Hierophant is like the counter to the high priestess, but it's in reverse. Um... So, yeah, you're discerning whether or not, like, this love is enduring and you can trust this person. But let's oh, also, oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. I keep saying also like that. Jeez. Um, and I'm not from New York. <laughs> but but I listen to a lot of things. Uh, I li I, anyways, I listen to a lot of Mickey, Nicki Minaj and she, said, she says also like that all the time. And I just find myself saying it. All right. Sorry. But, but, but this could be an apology. Also, this could be... Look at when pigs fly, and you're like, ah, oh, when pigs fly kind of thing. And maybe they they understand that, but they're not, let's see. King of Swords, not being truthful about something. King of Swords in reverse. So just be careful. You are on your discernment right now, which is great. You're protected, you're enlightened, but something is going to come out. So keep protecting yourself. Keep, and also don't, like, when you learn patterns and when you see a repetitive pattern over and you've been through the spiritual journey and people are telling you, oh, like, you know, don't be anxious. And you know what I mean? Like, it's just like, it's not even that. It's just like, I'm not anxious about it. I'm just studying you, <laughs> you know, like I'm just seeing what's going on. Like, I'm not, I'm, I'm using my discernment. And I think that's very powerful. There is a fine line between like being anxious and an intuition. And that's a whole other chat that we will have, darling. But, um, and it's all, I think a balance everyone, especially in the community you need to find. Anyways, so if you made it this far, thank you so much, darlings. Hit all those buttons. I do offer personal reads. I will, um, Put my email and my TikTok in the description down below, darlings. All right, love y'all. Thank you so much for making out, uh, making this far. I really appreciate everyone who watched it. Deuces.